Hey GeForce, welcome back to our coverage of Gamescom. I'm Julian and this is Mitch and Ash, and we are gonna talk about Battletech. So tell us about Battletech a little bit. Sure, Battletech is the first turn-based game in the MechWarrior universe in 27 years, so we're really excited about that. It's a single-player mercenary-style campaign where you travel around from star system to star system, taking missions from different employers. You're trying to maintain your stable of mech warriors, keep your ship afloat, pay everybody on time. Meanwhile, you're also interacting with a story where you are fighting a war on behalf of a queen who's been deposed and you're in the middle of a bloody civil war and you're doing special missions for her. And it's also got a single player skirmish mode and a multiplayer head to head mode. What's the actual gameplay of this game like? So it's turn based game. It's kind of like chess with giant stompy robots. It's cat and mouse game with a lot of visceral action to it. Ash, what was your contribution to this game? Paradox came in as a publisher later in the project. These guys obviously did a very good Kickstarter, you know, got a lot a lot of money from the community, a lot of support, but then they wanted that extra help, that extra resource, and so me and my producer role, I sort of focus on more of the game development aspect of that, making sure that everything seems to be on track, that these guys have everything they need to do a good job. So when you announced on Kickstarter, people just threw money at you guys. So now that you have all that capital to work with, What's your thinking on what you're going to put into this game and how you're going to build it? Because it's on Kickstarter, we explained exactly what we were going to make, and that's exactly what we're making. So we're very careful to do everything we told our fans that we were going to do in the first place. And we put out a beta that was very well received. We did another update last week, updated the AI, a bunch of game systems based on their feedback, and we added our first draft of multiplayer too, and they're playing that now, and they're really happy. Ash, when you saw the list of what the Kickstarter said they were going to promise, what was your reaction? The thing is, you know, Paradox has a history of that, right? You want that depth. You want that replayability. You want those passionate people who learn everything and optimize everything. But at the same time, you have to make the game accessible, easy to understand, intuitive, and so on. So, I mean, that's a big focus of what we're doing, right? And that's the natural and accepted part of every project that we do at Paradox. Cool. And if people still want to get in on that beta, is that possible? Yeah, you can. You can go to battletechgame.com and become a late backer and if you back it at the right level you can get into the beta right now cool it's a lot of fun it's really in-depth strategy but still really enjoyable thank you guys for letting us play it and oh, talk with us great. today thank you so much for tuning in here from our coverage at gamescom stay tuned to geforce lots more coverage coming your way